hey newman family welcome back to the ministry i'm gonna pray very quickly before i release this word this word is powerful and the holy spirit led me to study the scripture and i'm here to inspire and encourage somebody with this word heavenly father i give you all the glory praise and honor thank you for another wonderful day lord god to uplift my brothers and sisters in in the faith and i pray that as i begin to release this word i let somebody receive a miracle a testimony a breakthrough father oh god that according to your word in habakkuk oh lord let it truly come to pass for them as you have spoken it oh lord in this season in this hour in this time heavenly father and let this word glorify you in jesus name oh lord holy spirit speak through me have your way in jesus name amen hallelujah praise god i'm going to be reading from the book of habakkuk 1 verse 5 and that says look among the nations and see wonder and be astounded look among the nations and see wonder and be astounded for i am doing a work in your days that you would not believe if told i'm doing a work in your days that you would not believe if told i just want to encourage somebody very quickly just prepare yourself for what the lord is about to do in your life because these are such wonderful times. We are, we are such, we are in um, a wonderful time right now where the Lord is moving and doing all sort of miraculous things in the, in the uh, body of Christ. And I don't want you to feel like the Lord has forgotten you. I know many of us continue to feel that way for the longest time. I want you to be encouraged and understand that God loves you so much. The, the Lord loves you so much. God, God made me... <laughs> Oh, Father Lord, thank you. I just give you all the praise, Father Lord. Yesterday, I was, no, this morning, I was just laying down in bed. And immediately after um, studying, um, meditating upon the scripture in Habakkuk, I heard the Lord say, I love you. And and that, to me, just really touched me because I don't feel like I'm the most committed or the most dedicated individual um, or a child of God. I try to do my best, especially over the last nine months. It has been very, very difficult uh, for me being pregnant. I know you all know my testimony already. This, the, the pregnancy that I just had was extremely difficult but i still found um you know still still try to you know um release the word of god and uh serve you know god's people and and my husband and children and everything but it has been very very challenging but god has still been doing uh wonderful things and he has still been and still does astound me astonish me and i just want to encourage uh whoever is listening that the Lord is definitely going to come through for you. He will come through. And like he said in his world in Habakkuk 1.5, he says, prepare to see wonders. Okay. He says for you, um, you know, to um, understand that he's doing the work in uh, this time, in these days that you would not believe if told. That's what his word says. He says that he's doing the work in these days that you would not believe even if you were told. That should make you understand that God is a God of surprises, that he is definitely um gonna come through for you in such a way that would shock you and make you marvel amen but praise the lord family and yeah so that's the word for somebody so just remain encouraged and i'm gonna come back again today to release word number two and i'll see you all very very soon lots of love and god bless please subscribe if you're new uh, to new and church welcome be a part of the ministry i'm minister glenn and i'll see you all very very shortly god bless